I got a son. He, he, he raps. His, his rap name is Tut Tarantino. If you ever listen to some of his raps, I'm like, oh my God, where does this come from, son? You grew up in a gated community your whole life, but he's rapping my life because we romanticize and fantasize about that old thug life, ghetto life, and all of that stuff. Where Welcome to J1 Vlogs, man. Those are the words of the famous Michael Irvin, the football hall of famer. Listen, he calls out his son, Tut Torino, for all the gangster music and the gangster rap, the drill rap. You know what I mean? Listen, man, we need more fathers like that. We need more people in the community like that, more uncles like that who 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 know these little guys, you know what I mean, who can say something, you know what I mean, speak up, you know what I mean, embarrass them, you know what I mean? Because, listen, you know, I know in, in all due respect to Lil Tut Torino, he listened to a lot of these other dudes, you know what I mean? Um, He listened to people like Rick Ross, you understand what I'm saying? Rick Ross ain't a drill rapper, but Rick Ross rapping about a lifestyle he never lived. You understand? Talking about Port of Miami and all that. But he was in the jail working as a CO. You know, he listened to people like Plies. Plies the biggest fraud in Florida. You know what I mean? He ain't never lived nothing. Got him! All that old mess there. You know what I mean? Goon this and goon that. But you listen to him in an interview. Yes, sir. Um, expeditiously, please. He sound like T.I., you know what I mean? Using big words. He was homecoming king, best dress in high school, you know what I mean? Uh, these rappers, then you got this younger generation like Julio, Fulio, Young and Ace, you know what I mean? You got them guys out of Chicago. I don't know none of their names because I don't listen to none of them, but 600B, that's the only one I listen to. But, you know, he rapping and you know, it just, just the kid is a total fraud. You grew up in a 20,000 square foot house. You know what I mean? Daddy had money your whole life. You feel what I'm saying? Daddy worked hard to make sure you didn't have the lifestyle that he, that he had to grow up with. But that's the lifestyle you want to rap about. You know what I'm saying? And I like this. I like the fact that Michael Irvin exposed him. You know what I mean? Um, Hopefully, Jit changes his music. Hopefully, Jit start making some good music, make some music for females, you know what I mean? Get you some radio hits, man. Get you some get you some features or something. Your daddy's a legend. Your daddy got money, you know what I'm saying? And you would be better off legit, you know what I mean? Because rapping right now about being a gangster is over with. Your daddy not exposed you, you know what I mean? But in Jits, you know, in Jits' favor, he's no different from all these other rappers out here that's rapping about a lifestyle they never had. At the end of the day, they're just trying to entertain somebody, but you ain't going to get no money off the drill rap. You know what I mean? They're not booking you to come do a show with drill music. You know what I mean? Because they don't want to get the club shot up. They ain't trying to get nobody shot. They ain't trying to get no lawsuits. You know what I mean? So you can't get no money off of that. You know what I mean? And you don't want to drill rap anyway because, you know, you can't go nowhere. You can't, you can't do something simple as go out to eat with your girl or, Go out to eat with your family and have your kids around. You know what I mean? Because you got to constantly look over your shoulder and worry about whether or not somebody's going to shoot at you or try to kill you or a stray bullet might hit one of your babies. Or, you know what I mean? So I'm glad. Shout out to Michael Irvin, man, for exposing this on the Undisputed Show and uh, bringing the real out, man. You know what I mean? Shouts out to Michael Irvin. But, hey, man, that's just my thoughts. Y'all let me know in the comments what y'all think, man. If y'all agree we need more daddies like this, put some in the comments. If you don't, you know, let me know. Yeah, let me know still. Let me know what y'all come up with, man. Uh, subscribe to the channel. Like the video. Please share it. And I will catch you on the flip side. Peace.